Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to connect Equid to Facebook in 2023. So Equid, of course, is a versatile e-commerce platform and Facebook is a powerful social media platform. And this comprehensive guide will walk you through the essential steps to integrate Equid with Facebook for a seamless shopping experience. So make sure to stick by and follow this step-by-step -step guide. And of course, let's dive right into this video and simply Let's get started. Before we start with this video, make sure to watch us from now till the end so you have full experience. So first, we'll have to go and sign up for an Equid account. To do so, go and open whatever browser you're going to use to follow this tutorial steps with. Here in my case, I'm actually going to use the Brave browser. And of course, in your case, you can use any other browser that you could possibly have. Once you open that browser, go to the CRL section and basically here you'll have to type equid.com and hit the enter button. Once you do so, you'll be taken to their home screen or main screen right away. As I said, if you don't have an account and you know not, and don't know nothing about this, of course, you can first of all scroll down, read more information about this website, and basically familiarize yourself with it and have a general idea on how this website works. Then, if you're interested before on the price, and you can simply go and I'll just click here. You can see it's all by your own. Post the check all the features. This is annually and this monthly. And of course, if you have an account, just go to the top right corner and click on login here. And if you don't have an account, click on get started for free, depending on your situation. For me, I'll just go and click on login. And of course, they will log me right away into my control panel or my dashboard because I've already logged in before. And I checked the option of remember me so I don't keep logging in over and over. Once you, you just, if you just created your account or logged into your account, make sure first of all to finish this those six steps. As you can see, very simple. I've finished just uh, create your account. As you can see, so 70%. Make sure to make it 100%. What we'll need to do simply go now to the left panel. And as you can see here on the sales channels, we'll find Facebook. We'll be able to connect Facebook on Equid very easily. Go to the left panel, click on Facebook, and it will take you here. As you can see, I'll not be able to connect that unless I go and upgrade one of their plans. Click on here, as you can see, you will need the venture plan if you need to or if you want to connect this Facebook to your Equid store. Other than that, you will not be able to. Even if, as an example, go to apps, if you're app markets, look for Facebook here. But look if there are some free options. As you can see, there's no Facebook app, so you'll not be able to do it other than this option. So make sure to go and get your app and, of course, uh, it gets your plan. And with that plan, you'll get an Instagram shop, a mobile app for store management, gift card, advanced SEO tools, custom domain name, chat support, and a lot of other stuff. Of course, uh, make sure to even, uh, once you do so, go and basically just enable the facebook shop and connect your facebook shop you'll find everything here so just click on it and connect it follow the prompt to connect your equid store to facebook shop and set up your facebook shop you can add products of course all to your facebook shops, uh, shop from equid and monitor even and manage orders engage with customers and even promote your fa like facebook shop if you want to through like facebook page posts or and even advertising campaigns to reach a wider audience and facebook and even instagram that if you want to get a plan. If you don't want to get a plan, I have another option for you. If you want to keep using it for free, you can simply now go and open a new tab and simply you will have to use another website called Zapier. Go, open a new tab and type zapier.com and hit the enter button. Once you do so, make sure again to create an account. So let me just log out first. As you can see, so log out, log in into your account again at the top right corner if you have an account. And if you don't, click on sign up to create a new account. You can even use Google if you don't want to get through all the boring steps of logging in or even creating your account, which I will do here. And as you can see, I'll be on my account right away. Now, what you will need to do is simply go to the Flex panel and click on apps. Here, make sure to go and search for apps and search for Facebook. For me, I already have Facebook connected. For you, of course, make sure to go and click on it. Click on connect as example. And this will take you here. So make sure to uh, log in into your Facebook here. Once you're logged in into it, just go back, go now and click on create a zap. Of course, you can use this AI tool that will help you do everything. As an example, so uh, I'll just do when I add a product on my Equid store, add the product on my facebook also as simple as that and click on generate 
as example. So this is this you will need to create some triggers, some actions. If you don't want to do that or you don't know how to do that exactly, you can simply make or use this AI tool that will make everything very easy for you. So as you can see here, Equid by Lightspeed products added, updated, may not be currently supported by us. So send us a request. So don't worry about that. They even like users, you can see here. So don't worry, just go and click on try it. Once you click on try it, you'll find it here. You'll find the equid as a trigger and the Facebook as an action. So click on trigger, as you can see, once uh, you get a new products, as you can see, as an event on uh, equid, click on continue. You'll have, of course, to sign in to your account, click on sign in. And here, once you click on sign in, of course, if you're already signing, I'll just go and click on accept. Here, basically, as, as simple as that, because I'm already like signing into, our, into my account. And as you can see, now once I am signing, it should change like soon. So authorization is expired. I'll just have to connect. So basically, I'll just like connect again. Or maybe they have like a problem in the server at the moment. So don't mind that. So basically, just connect. Once you connect, just go again to Facebook and make sure to connect to that. As you can see, yeah, it's where it's the problem, same problem for Facebook. So they just have a problem. So basically, once you connect on both like those options, just go to action and choose the action that it should be made by Facebook. Here, the accent, as we said, is adding the same products on your page on Facebook. So, of course, you'll have to go and choose the page, depending on the Facebook that you'll link. So, I'll just choose here, like, uh, I have a page called, like, Etsy Shop Tester. For you, of course, depending on your page, just add the page here. You can uh, select an image or um, make it imageless. Then you can add the image by your own, like, manually. And you can even add the description. Once you finish, of course, click on Continue. And once you click Continue, click on Test Step. And of course, as you can see, filter creates a page for uh, pages because they need the photo. I did not add a photo. So basically, make sure for you, make sure to add your photo. And basically, you'll be good to go. Of course, make sure to test all those steps or basically like Zapier will test everything for your own. If everything is working correctly, you'll be able to take it on. And once you add your products in Equid, it will be added directly to Facebook. And that's how you basically, you can connect it, but not in like a direct way. You'll have to use Zapier and it might be a bit concerning for people that don't use it much. If you just want to go for the safe option, you can simply go and get a plan and connect it from here and you will be good to go. So if you reach this point of this video, congratulations, you've successfully connected Equid to Facebook in 2023. With this integration, of course, you can sell products directly through your Facebook presence, enhancing the shopping experience for your followers on Facebook. So make sure to regularly update and promote your products on Facebook to maximize those sales. And make sure you can even use like Facebook ads, Instagram ads, or any other ads program that you want to use. So that's going to be it for us today. If you like this video, make sure to leave a like down below and subscribe for our channel for more helpful tours like this one. If you have any concern, you can leave it on the comment section. And that's going to be it. So thank you for watching and happy selling. And I'll see you in the next video.